What's up everybody? Today we're talking about how to build a better camera team for your church live streaming services. Whether you're just starting out or have been doing it for a while, having a strong camera team is essential for producing a rich and engaging worship experience. First up, training, training, training. You want to provide ongoing training and support to help your camera operators. Make sure that you show them examples of what you want your broadcast to look like. Give them all the opportunities to know the reasons why you want it to look that way. Make sure that you're showing them framing options, shot options, movement options. Next, you wanna make sure that you're up to date with your team on all the latest techniques and technology. Use this to improve their skills. Use it to improve their knowledge and give them all the tutorials, videos, any way that you can help them along the way to become better operators. You hear me say this a lot, that gear is not necessarily something to truly focus on, but there are times when looking into investing in the right gear, like cameras, lenses, accessories that can make the camera rigs better and easier to hold, or even making your tripods better, it will help your team get into a comfortable position while capturing, and it ensures them that they have the tools that they need to engage in worshiping through their craft. We hear it often that we don't wanna be a distraction to a service so that people in the room can worship. Well, I think as church leaders, we should always look at ways to make our team as comfortable as possible so that they can truly focus on worshiping first and capturing second. Next, you wanna create a positive and collaborative work environment where your team feels super supported. Listen, set clear goals, expectations for your team, and provide regular feedback and guidance. Help them improve and grow. Don't be afraid of having those hard conversations when your standards are not being upheld. And finally, while this may not always be the case, there may be times when you have to look into hiring experienced cam ops to come in and get the shots that you need for a particular project. This is also the perfect opportunity to utilize these professional camera ops to train your team and show them different techniques that they can use when they're on camera. A lot of times also, as a director, having a set of fresh professional eyes coming in from the outside can truly help you see things and capture things in a different way. One last thing, and honestly, it's the main thing. If you focus on your team first and create the right culture, you can make any worship service experience both engaging as well as memorable, not just for those that are watching your broadcast, but for you and your team as well. All right, I wanna hear from you. Let me know in the comments any tips and tricks that you've used either in the past or currently that has helped your operators become better. Thanks for watching, and as always, never forget to worship first and capture second.